let's take a look at that word live Jesus is referring to. In the Greek, the word is zao, from Luke 4, verse 4. And Hebrew chaya, from Deuteronomy chapter 8, verse 3. Both words have the same meaning, which is not only life, but also a restoring and reviving. Now here's the important part. The restored and revived life referred to is both physical and spiritual. Remember what the Bible says in the last part of Deuteronomy chapter 8, verse 3. He did it to teach you that people do not live by bread alone. Rather, we live by every word that comes from the mouth of the Lord. There's that word live again. And it means the same thing here. Yes, God provided bread for the Israelites' physical nourishment. However, he also provided the bread so as to restore and revive their life in all of the promises God has for his people. And that's why Jesus quoted the scripture to the devil. Jesus is saying to Satan, it's more important that my life focuses on my heavenly father's promises and will for my life than on food. Jesus knew and wants all of his believers to know God provided all that his people needed back during the time of the Israelites and still does today. Mm -hmm.